Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be trying some Japanese candy. I've always wanted to go to Japan, but seeing as that's not looking like it's an option for at least a little while yet, I decided to get a Japanese candy box. So I'm going to be trying these sweets and snacks with you guys today. I'm going to start with this. I don't have a clue what it is, it feels kind of solid. Um, okay, it looks... Oh, it's got a hold on the middle. It looks like it's going to be savoury. Smells a little bit spicy. not very spicy it's like it's definitely savoury I can't put my finger on what flavour it is but it's good it's like harder than a what's it but just a sim very similar texture to a what's it. Mm. I'm going to try this, it looks like a marshmallow. Feels a little bit harder than a normal marshmallow. Like it looks like a little flump. Okay. Okay, so it looks like a little flump. It's a little tougher and chewier than a normal marshmallow. Yeah, it's a little tough, tougher and chewier than a normal marshmallow, but it tastes just like a regular marshmallow. Okay, next I'm going to try this. I have no clue what this is. It looks like it says wasabi nori. Um, So it's like, it's quite sticky. Mmm. Ooh. Oh. oh. When you first bite into it, it's really sweet. And like quite sticky and chewy. And then once you start chewing it, all you can taste is wasabi very wasabi so i'm going to try this little it looks a little bit like a marshmallow again it's a strawberry flavor a little strawberry marshmallow hopefully light and fluffy marshmallow filled with like strawberry cream mm. that's good okay next I'm going to try this it looks like fish sticks I think this is just fish sticks I've had fish sticks before and I quite like them hopefully you like these so it's just little Yeah, so it's just little fish sticks. They don't taste too fishy like you would expect them to if you just had fish sticks. But I like these, they're nice and salty. Next, I'm going to go for this. It looks like a little chocolate cake in the shape of a flower, but it feels quite hard. So I'm gonna guess it's some sort of chocolate biscuit. Oh, 
oh wow this is good it's like a airy fluffy chocolate biscuit mm -hmm. mm. That was amazing. I really like that. I think that's possibly my favourite one so far. Next up is this little packet here. I can't see what's in the packet or it feels quite hard, like a little heart shape it sort of feels like. Like a little hard heart. And oh, it's a little chocolate. It's a little heart shaped chocolate. another one of the what's it type things I think it's a similar snack just a different flavor so we shall see oh it's orange it smells like cheese it smells quite cheesy I think this is like the cheese flavor mm. it's like a giant what's it but just straight with a hole through the middle. Mm -hmm. Melon Pandora. It looks like a melon flavoured panda cookie. Oh, yes, Pandora brand butter cookie. So it looks like a melon flavoured cookie. Mm, on the back there's a little, um, what do you call it? Ooh. Oh, I'm missing an ear. What's in here? Try the ear first. Mm. It's way more melony than I expected, but also nowhere near as melony as I expected. Mm. That's a good cookie. So I'm going to try this now. It feels like lots of little crispy balls. I'm gonna guess that it's savoury. Okay, it's just little balls like this. Salty. They just taste just a little bit salty. Like they they taste like fried rice paper with a bit of salt. But a lot fluffier and more airy. This feels like a little hard sweet. Oh, it's got two little bits to it, so it's broken because it feels like. Broken it in half. Okay. Ooh. It smells very sherbetty. Mm. I think it's just little bits of gum. Strawberry flavoured. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think that one's just strawberry flavoured gum. Quite. I wasn't expecting it to be gum, it was quite soft. But this, it looks like some dried sort of fruit. The packaging makes me think that it's going to be sweet because it's pink, but she's holding, the little girl in the corner is holding like a bowl. So I don't know if it's going to be sweet or savoury. Soft and weird. Mm. It's almost like a sweeter, sharper dried apricot. It's like soft and gooey on the inside.
but also quite sharp. Next up is Texas corn. So these look like little puffy savoury balls, like crisps, but puffs. Mm. Yeah, they just taste a bit like corn puffs. They don't have a flavour to them really. Okay, I'm gonna go for another one of the giant what's it type things. This one is teriyaki. So I'm just gonna expect the same as the others, just teriyaki flavour. It's quite light. It smells like teriyaki. It's not as teriyaki as I expected it to be. It's quite a mild flavour. I have another one of those marshmallow type things with the filling. Feels the exact same as the other one so far. Oh, it's a chocolate one. Mm -hmm. It's nice. It's chocolate and chocolate moussey saucy type thing and soft marshmallow. And I now have another one of wasabi sheet ones. I have another one of these. I can't tell what flavour this one is, but it feels the same so far. It's sticky again. It's stuck to the pit plastic. Okay, it's very sticky. Oh. Mm. So it's still got a bit of that wasabi flavour. But it's nowhere near as wasabi. -y. Very sticky. It tastes a bit like a giant sticky fish stick with wasabi. So the sun is just setting in the corner over there, so I've tried to cover it up a little bit and make it a bit better. I'm going to try this little. Looks like a sweet. Feels quite jelly y. I have no clue what to expect or how to open it. Um. It looks like a bit of jelly. Ooh. It's very stretchy and a little bit sticky. It smells like grapes. Mm-hmm. Mm. It tastes quite like the Grape Fanta. I think I just finished the Jelly Sweet. The grape flavoured jelly, that was quite nice. My camera just died as I was halfway through eating it. But that was really nice. I really want to get some more of them, but I don't know what they're called to search for them. So next I am going to try Another one of the marshmallow ones. Mm. I think it's banana. But it's quite a nice, it's not too banana y, it's quite like a nice sweet banana. It's like the flavour of the banana, it's hard banana sweets but soft. I'm going to try the last one of the giant 
it looks like it's another fish flavour. Okay, so it's not quite as sticky as the last one. Mm. This one's my favourite one out of the three. It's not very wasabi at all. There's a little tiny bit of heat, but that's about it. It's really good. Mm. Okay, next I have, look, all I can see on this is Jack. They look like mini Smarties or mini M&Ms. It's weird because they're in like this bubble medicine packaging. They just taste like Smarties. Mm. They just taste like Smarties, but slightly more chocolatey than Smarties. Last in the box is this one. It says corn potage or potage. Looks like a giant what's it type thing the blandest colour yet mm. it tastes a bit chivey it tastes quite chivey and the like colour on it is very similar to the colour of the Texas corn so yeah, they look almost the same, just a bigger version of these. The texture is different, the tex Texas corn is a lot denser and this is very light and fluffy. And the flavour is slightly different, I much prefer this. Mm. It's sweeter than the Texas corn. But yeah, there we go, the box is empty, it's just a bit of paper that has the Japanese date format. So there we go, there's, I think there was 20 different Japanese snacks and sweets in that box, and there were only a few that I, well, one? Hmm. There was only one that I didn't like, and that was the wasabi fish stick thing. But yeah, other than that, I'm very impressed. Not as much sweet snacks as I expected. They were mostly savoury, which was quite nice. That was quite nice. So if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, leave a comment and subscribe and turn the notification bell on so when I do get a chance to go to Japan, you will know when the video is up. See you next time. Bye!